Hi, I'm Blaze Broder here at Monadnock Speedway, uh, along with Robert Baggett, Northeast Racing Media. And uh, just a quick minute to take the time out to thank some of our sponsors, Empower Financial Advisory out of Glastonbury, Connecticut. Thank you, uh, Nick Papakota and Nick Service Center down in North Brantford, Connecticut, uh, in US 1, I believe. Uh, rent a race car. Uh, out of Berlin, Connecticut. Give them a call if you ever feel like going racing at Stafford Motor Speedway. And of course, the West Chatham Grill, Doug Missouri Sr. Uh, if anybody's on vacation in Cape Cod, stop in West Chatham Grill and get yourself probably one of the best sandwiches in all of Cape Cod. But uh, thanks to all our sponsors, and uh, we'll bring you highlights tonight here at Manadnock Speedway. We'll talk to you soon. This one, too, you all right? Okay, uh, welcome race fans. We're here in the pits at Manadnock Speedway on a beautiful Saturday afternoon, and we're here coincidentally with Scott McMichael, driver of the number seven, the Larry Cirillo owned uh, uh, limited, I mean the Sportsman, Sportsman Modified, modified yeah. uh, here at Manadnock. And uh, Scott, how you running? Tell us where you where you're at and what's going on. Well, uh, I, I I drove for a different fellow at the beginning of the year. We parted ways, and then Larry, all of a sudden, I said. Uh, I want to drive your car, and he said, I want you to drive my car. So, hey, we, we're here. We're, it's like our, I don't know, fifth or sixth weekend, and we're just, uh, uh, you know, yeah, we're yeah. just learning it. But we, we've had some good runs. We've had some, we've broken quite a bit of things. You know, I've I broken Larry's car quite a few times on him. Yeah. But other than that, um, we've had fun. And, you know, i got to thank him and Dee or, and the guys that helped me because we wouldn't have been here without them for sure. This is what we, uh, we're all having a good time. That's the thing. It's all smiles here. You know, yeah. even if we don't do good, we we're smiling. If we do good, we're really smiling. So, <laughs> yeah. Well, best of luck to you tonight uh, here at Manadnock, and uh, we hope to see you up front. We'll be talking to you later. Yeah, awesome. We can't wait. Hopefully, we get a win tonight. Thank you. Okay. And that's Scott McMichael here in the pits of Manadnock. Test you on. All right, we're here in the pits once again at Manadnock here with uh, Matthew Kimball and. Driver of the number 50 Sportsman Mod and a guy that does double, triple duty sometimes throughout the season. Uh, you're here with your mod tonight. Yeah, it's just uh, me, my dad, my brother, and Brandon here. Uh, we just come here when we can, have fun, and um, we'll, we'll race again tomorrow in Oxford. Nice. Oxford, Oxford, Maine. Maine. No kidding. Yeah, yeah there's a big show going on uh, this weekend. Uh, yeah, it's 250 weekend. There's a fill-in show. There's the Northeast Mini Stock Tour, and we're leading the points by one point. So wow, good for you. We're going to go home, load up. Well, unload, unload this, load, load up. Yeah, and then leave at 5 a.m. in the morning. So, well, best of luck to you, man. Thank you. All right, that's Matt Kimball. Here you have it. Uh, hit man that knock pits. All right. Best, uh, yep. Okay, we're out back of the pit area here in the uh, trucks, the Exit Realty Truck Series, uh, with Jerry Giordano Jr. And uh, you've got a good season going for you so far, this buddy. Uh, you got a you got a win at Lee. You got a couple of seconds at Thompson. Uh, you got a beautiful, beautiful effort going on here. I'm sure it's a family-orientated uh, thing. So uh, tell us a little about it. Well, uh, it's just me and my dad in that garage. We're kind of sing every week. Mostly him because I work late. But, yeah, we work harder than this thing than we do on our late models. So, you know, we're really trying this year to get the championship. Well, you got, you got a good points season going thus far in, in the Exit Realty Series. Yeah, really in points right now. And hopefully we keep it that way for the rest of the year. Well, good luck to you, buddy, and uh, best of luck to you here tonight at Manadnock. I mean, it's, I mean, that pretty much, you, you, I think you got to, uh, you can edit this. So. All right, and uh, let us know your uh, sponsors that, and the people that get you here. All right, most importantly, my dad, my friend, my girlfriend, parents, family. But uh, I got K1 Logistics, good people. Um, you got uh, Exit Realty, the, the truck series. They don't sponsor, you know, they sponsor everyone. But yeah, Derek uh, Pitcher, good people. Guy. Yeah. Yep. Uh, Steve Prime Meats. You got Langdon's Automotive. Those guys, they kept my truck in their shop all last year when I was getting done. So they're the best. They come out to help us too. Sure. You got uh, Steve Prime Meats. Um, that's really it. All right. Well, for best, best, best of luck. Of you couldn't do all this without those sponsors, and of course your dad and yourself. Yeah. Uh, you're doing a great job. Yeah, and we're coming on. One more is joining us this year. And that'll probably be on the car soon, next week or so. so All right, we very good, very good. Well, best of luck to you, and congratulations on your effort thus so far. You're leading by a point, right? No, I'm leading by, I'm leading by a few. I'm oh, leading. okay. All right. All I right. thought it was just one, but <laughs> but best of luck to you, man. Uh, have a good night. You too. All right, that's Joey Giordano here in the pits. Test. All right, in the pits uh, with the uh, Exit Realty Truck Series and Zach Robinson. 
uh, a limited sportsman driver at Thompson and wherever else he can run. But, uh, Zach, uh, you're in a truck for the first time tonight here at Benadnock. Tell us a little about it. Oh, it's, you know, we're looking to get seat time. We're going up to Safford next year in a late model. Uh, this is a three-link truck, same thing as the Safford late model, so we're just hoping to get some good seat time. All right, well, best of luck there tonight. I know you guys are working on the truck. Anybody want to thank? Uh, I definitely want to thank everybody, my whole crew, Joe Brockett, Dwayne Knoll, my stepdad, my girlfriend, my mom, just everybody, my grandparents. Uh, definitely, definitely Royal Screw Manufacturing. All right, well, best of luck to you tonight, your thank first you. time in the truck, so good luck. Yes. All right, this kid's a driving machine. That's Zach Robinson. All right, we're here in the Exit Realty and Truck Series with uh, my good friend Dwayne Knowles, last year's 2018 track champion at the Speed Bowl. And the Speed Bowl, of course, is what we all miss. But in any case, you're here at Manadnock tonight, and uh, have you got a chance to get out yet? Yeah, we've been out once. Uh, I think we set fast time, so we're looking forward to going back out. A little tweak here, tweak there, and uh, having a good time. We're uh, running a bowl truck in the in the tour division. Looking forward to getting back to the bowl with the bowl truck. Um, <laughs> this is fun, but no place like home. No, that's right. I agree. I agree. Totally agree. And you're working with Zach Robinson here, uh, helping them out. Yeah, Zach. Um, yeah, as everybody knows, runs at Thompson, and and um, he's leading the points at Stafford now, and. Uh, Gave me an opportunity to uh, to drive my other truck. I have three of them, and no sense in having two of them just sit and uh, right. see how it goes. And it, it can benefit me. We're going to see how that goes, and if it's good enough, maybe we'll be. I can drive either one. So, you know, the big picture is looking at championship. The way this series is set up, it comes down to the last race. Right. So I want to be able to have the best possible vehicle underneath me for that last race. Sure, sure. absolutely. It's well, not legal for the bowl, but. Uh, the bowl uh, racing, I think I, I can do all right there with what I got. Right. And I'm sure you have, well, yeah, I mean, you always do. But the touring division is where it's at right now. Unfortunately, the bowl's not open, but uh, best of luck to you tonight. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. No problem. That's Dwayne Knowles here in the Pitts Exit Realty Truck Series. Okay, once again, back here in the Pitts in the Truck Series for Exit Realty. And Chris Ivory, nice to see you back, buddy. He's from Montville, Connecticut, driver in the number 54, Hamilton Market sponsored entry. And uh, have you been out yet? And how's the truck? Uh, we went out for one practice, definitely a little free. Um, working on a little, not something I'm used to with this track. It's a lot different than Waterford and Thompson. It is. So. So it's a, it's, this is this is a scary place almost, isn't it? Uphill, downhill. Not too bad. Just a lot of thr uh, throttle control. Yeah. Yeah. So. All right. Well, best of luck to you tonight. Uh, uh, we wish you the best, dude. It's good to see a hometown right. kid. Yeah. Thank you. All right. You're welcome. That's Chris Ivory here in the pits at Gananda. We're here in the pits in the truck series once again. Brian Zamowski. Yep. Uh, he's from Summers, Connecticut. Yep. Good effort. Uh, I don't know if you've run Manadnock this year. We've been here once this year. We're brand new to the truck series. We came out of the uh, Legend series down at Waterford, okay. so we're getting used to big body stuff now. Yeah, well, good for you, and, and hopefully we'll get open sooner or later absolutely, at the bowl. Absolutely, absolutely. We're all hoping for yeah, it. Yeah, so. I know we are. If not, 2020 is going to be one kick-ass season, absolutely. I'll tell you Absolutely. You know, Mike's doing a great job down he really there. Is. So, he really is. Uh, Wish them all the best, and hopefully they get it done. That we will. All right. Anybody you want to thank tonight for yeah. your efforts? Um, obviously, my father is the biggest one for us. Um, if it wasn't my father and my wife, um, we wouldn't be racing. Sure. We've got a great sponsor in the uh, Ed McGovern Allstate Agency. Um, we get help from Reliable Welding and a lot of other people that you know just can't get money, but just everything to get this thing here every week. Sure. So Good for you. Perfect. We wish you the best, Brian. Thank you very much. All right, this is Brian Zamowski here, here in the pits. in the uh, pit area with the uh, truck series. Once again, we're covering the truck series today, Northeast Racing Media. And Lucas Leone, uh, how's your year gone so far? We've had a really good year so far. Uh, I can't complain about it. We've had a lot of top fives, all top fives, actually. Still looking for that, la that win, though, but we're working for it. Well, you've had one round of practice. Uh, how'd the truck feel for you? you tweaking it a little? Uh, so far, we have something solid. Uh, we're looking to change some little things, make it a little bit better for the long runs. Uh, hopefully, we'll be good during the feature. All right. Well, best of luck to you tonight, qualifying and your feature event. Thank you. That's Lucas Leone here in the pits. Okay, a quick minute here in the pits. Back here in the back 40, if you will, Joel Monahan, driver of the 03, this beautiful modified here at Manadnock Speedway. And, and uh, I think, Joel, the last time we were here, dude, you had a little issue on the track. Uh, you you kind of wrecked your front end, but you came back strong. Yeah, that uh, that was just racing. I mean, I came into turn three high and got hit in the left front. And uh, luckily, they once we came in on the wrecker, they had a wreck out there and we were able to get fixed back up. And yeah, we made it back out for third, so that was good because yeah. that could have put a huge change on the season. But uh, so far, so good. Yeah, I think about five more left. You might have won that thing, but good for you, dude. You run great here. Yeah, thank you. We tried to. Uh, 
I couldn't do it out with my dad, my Uncle Terry, uh, Donnie Wood with Rat Auto Machine, Greg and Ryan Felton, Bob Phil, uh, BFR Chassis, Amherst Insurance, uh, all the people that make these things go around. That's right. And of course, Monahan Trucking. Yeah, Monahan Trucking's <laughs> in there too. <laughs> okay, then Joel Monahan, you're in the pits of Banana. Thank you. All right, we're here in the mini stock pits out back here in uh, Nate Wenzel, uh, third generation driver out of Granby, Mass. Uh, fifth in points here at Monadnock in the mini stock division. And uh, have you got a chance to get out? And how's your car? Um, yeah, uh, I went out twice so far. The car is really good. It's always really good. Um, just waiting to go out for the heat race. High hopes for that. Well, we've been watching you, Robert and I, and you seem to be doing pretty good, kid. Thank you. How old are you? 16. 16 years old. All right, watch this young man to get to the front here in the mini stock feature event tonight here at Monadnock. Thank you, Nate. Yep. No problem. Right next door to where we were just at with Nate Wenzel. We bumped into Tim Wenzel, another third generation driver. And uh, Tim, where are you standing in points at this point? Uh, I think we're running seventh right now. Okay. But now it's just we had a couple of uh, DQs at the beginning of the year, some minor stuff that we overlooked. So. Right, and so you got a chance to go a couple times out in practice tonight. How's the car? Car's good. Car's in real good. So we had some rubber, uh, some crappy tires on for first practice, and then second practice we put the good tires on. Yeah. Car's good. So Scuff them up for the future. Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, best of luck to you tonight. Thanks. All right. That's Timmy Wenzel here in the pits. Okay. Over here in the late model department, if you will, Willie Kuhn, driver of this beautifully prepared number zero, uh, of course, with help from one of your famous buddies, but uh, how are you running tonight? Oh, so it was okay in practice. We may try to throw some something at it for the uh, heat and features, see what we got. All right. Uh, anybody? I'm confident. Uh, huh? I'm confident, though. Tonight. Yeah, well, good. You guys run good here. It's a nice car. Yeah. I mean, it's set up well, so yeah. uh, I just want to wish you the best of luck tonight, Thank and you. I'm sure Robert does, too. And uh, uh, is your buddy coming? Tom? <laughs> yeah, I didn't want to say his name. <laughs> I don't think he's coming tonight. Not no. tonight, no. No, he had a good night last night. He won at yep. Stafford. Yep. So, yep. yeah. But yep. best of luck to you, Willie. That's the most important thing right now is you here at Manhattan, dude. That's right. Thank yep. you. All right. You're welcome. Thank you. Okay. You got a copy? Okay. We're once again back here in the Exit Realty Trucks pits, if you will. Ariana Jensik and uh, Ariana, your second race or your third? Uh, yeah, this is my second here at Monadnock. My first was Lee last week, Friday, so really excited to learn new stuff, uh, figure out new tracks and race with new people. So. And you're doing good? You come from a good family here of racers, so... Uh... Yeah, I've been racing for seven years. This yeah. is definitely something different. Um, doing well keeping up so okay a new thing for you so uh but good luck to you tonight and uh, all the best and keep it up keep up the good work thank you so much okay that's ariana jensik here in the pits one two three eight nine ten all righty all right exit realty pits once again with uh one of the hot shoes here uh jacob perry driving the number 71 uh there's two of two 271s tonight but uh you hot ticket you uh how's the truck running Actually, we're struggling a little bit today. Uh, we're trying to get a little bit more forward bite. Uh, truck's a little bit tight, but we're in really good shape. The truck's feeling pretty good. Motor feels strong. Um, I like the competition tonight. We got a good field of trucks, 19 cars. It's the uh, best one we've had all year, I believe, and my favorite track. So I'm super excited to be out here. Uh, thank the trucks. Thank Marshall for having us on. Got to thank the Jensik family for allowing me to drive their truck. Um, huge, huge thank you to them. Uh, it's cool to be able to be out there with a the car owner. So super fun. We're going to have a good show tonight. All right. A couple more tweaks before you go back out for the feature or qualifying? Of course. Uh, I came in, jacked it up, threw some stagger at it. Um, going to be making a couple more changes here and there and hopefully we can get this thing settled. And I know we'll have a good truck for tonight. Crew Chief's on the game. So we'll have a good truck and I hope to see you interview me later in Victory Lane. Absolutely, I will. That's Jacob Perry in the pits, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, guys. Okay, we're here in the Exit Realty Truck Pits once again with Mr. Rick Ashlaw, Manchester, Connecticut driver, my hometown. And uh, Rick, how's the truck running tonight uh, so far in practice? Well, we went from being super tight in the first practice, and we did spring change and went out second practice, and we're stupid loose. <laughs> so now we made a change. So hopefully, for the qualifier, we'll be right dead on. Right. That's what we're looking for. All right, and I'm sure there's some people you want to thank that got you here to Manhattan Knock tonight. Oh yeah, yeah. We got uh, Fowler's uh, Welding Supply. We got Standard Welding. Um, I mean, they who else? We got Snap On Dealers. We've got uh oh, who else do we have on this you truck? Got a lot, buddy. Uh, positive battery, we've got um, Crank It Up, MetalFortressRadio.com, they sponsor me, you know, Waddell, a good group of people. Waddell Communications, Exit Realty, oh, all yeah. of people all that help. Guys. 
Huh? Oh, and of course, uh, a power plant that well, is one, like one none of one of the. I'm one of two guys in the series that actually are a Ford-bodied Ford-powered truck. I'm 50 cubic inches lower than anybody else in the series, and I'm still competitive. So right. I'm glad to be a Ford. Me too, buddy. It's yep. nice to see the distributor in front, I'll tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's Rick Ashlaw from Manchester, Connecticut, up here at Manadnock Speedway in New Hampshire. Uh, look for this guy to go to the front. Thank you, guys. Thank Have you. Have a good night. All right. All right, we're in the Exit Realty Truck Series pits and with Brian Norman. Brian, you're climbing back into the number one uh, <laughs> for tonight here at Manadnock. So tell us about it. Yeah, we... Uh, Mike and I have been buddies for a couple years now. This was actually my old speedball truck. That's right. We sold it to Mike. He had some fun with it last year. And like two, three weeks ago now, these guys called me up and they said, hey, man, why don't you get in the truck? And I tried everything, everything, everything to get Mike to drive. And he's like, you know, I just want to go to the track, sit in the trailer, have fun, make some laughs. So I said, you know what? Between Bo and I, we'll make you guys freaking mm -hmm. laugh. And that's what we're doing today. So, mm -hmm. but it, uh, it's fun. I'm glad to get back in it. Sure. I'm very, very thankful that these guys thought enough of me to ask me to drive it. And uh, I gotta thank Jack and Mike and uh, Baldwin Stables and Olsen Sanitation and 100% Wraps because uh, without them guys, I'd still be sitting on my couch in the air conditioning. Yeah, roger that. So how's the truck running? You come out twice, I think? Yeah, we've been out twice. We uh, This truck hasn't been on the track in like 11 months, so we're working some stuff out, new brakes, stuff like that. So we kind of threw out a round setting the brakes and, you know, and I'm shaking off a little dust myself. So, <laughs> you know, we're just going to keep up with the track. We got a truck that's really consistent. We're not lightning fast. We're not... Yeah. yeah, you know, what I think we'll be, be like, yeah, I yeah. think this thing's not going to fall off. Like I said, Mike's got a nice piece here, man. I know the guy who built it, so yeah. I'm happy about that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, best of luck to you tonight. Yeah, I appreciate that, man. Thanks. All right, Brian Norman here in the pits. Okay, in the pits here at the Exit Realty Truck Series, Andy Lindemann, driver of the number three, uh, black Earnhardt truck, if you will. Boy, this thing goes. Yeah, it's... Uh, it's, it's, I rebuilt the whole thing over the winter. Uh, everything is good on it now. I had a motor problem the last race, so that's why I didn't make it. Uh, so I fixed the problem. Uh, and right today, she's uh, she's going good. I think I got most of the bugs finally worked out of it. So That was my next question. Uh, yeah, well, yeah, hopefully, we, if we get out front, we can stay off front. So. All right. Well, best of luck to you tonight, Andy. I certainly appreciate it. And uh, I want to, want to thank all you guys for what you do here with the interviews and stuff. And uh, you know, all the fans and the racers and stuff. So. Thank you, and thank you. Anybody you want to thank that got you here besides yourself? Well, my uh, brother, Dale Lindemann Construction, is a sponsor on it. I don't have any of my sponsors really on the truck yet because yeah. I'm in the process of maybe painting it if I survive tonight. <laughs> uh, Dawson's Towing, Fane, it's got a lot of a lot of good uh, sponsors on it. Uh, so, yeah, they helped me out a lot to get me to do this. All right, well, best of luck to you tonight, man. Give it hell. All right, thank you very much. Andy Lindemann in pits. Okay, Exit Realty Pits once again with Josh Stringer. Josh, you've had two rounds of practice. How is this truck tonight? Uh, it's it's a handful right now. I'm getting used to the track again. Uh, we made some adjustments, so it's it's pretty loose. But I think it's tight and it's getting loose off. So we'll see what it does. We do what the adjustments that we made for qualifying. All right, so uh, you've already made those adjustments and you're hoping for the best, I guess. Yeah, basically, we're in the top 10, so that's all we can really count on. So this is basically a practice to see if the adjustment works, and then all we can do is try and pick them off. All right, let's uh, invite one of my buddies in, Johnny Gates, uh, infield commentator for Stafford Motor Speedway and Waterford Speedball. And, Johnny, anything you want to add to Josh? Yeah, Josh, I tell you what, it's good seeing you here. Top top flight driver for sure. Uh, I noticed you got some new sponsors on this truck, including Tick Mike. Uh, how about some of them sponsors? Uh, Tick Mike I got this year with the competition. He's a huge help this year. I got RB Green Trucking this year. He's new on. Uh, CPR, Zip Steiner, uh, Drock Trucking, uh, Standard Welding. There's a lot. Nah, Scott Jibo and Son. I got a lot of sponsors. They all help out in every way. Uh, Boyle Racing is helping out as much as they can. My parents, my fiance for always putting up with me at the house and letting me go work on this thing and actually race it, especially with a baby at home. So it all helps. Yeah, I wanted to say congratulations. I know you got a, a, a new boy. How old's the baby? Uh, show him his 10 months now. 10 months? Okay. And uh, so that's what you've been doing with yourself. I know we haven't seen you out much at the racetrack. Uh, you still got it. 
I think I still got it, so we'll see. Josh Stringer could be going to the front here tonight in our Exit Realty Pro Truck 55 lap main event. Okay, another one of our truck competitors, Tommy Metcalf. Tommy, you brought one truck tonight. Usually you're good for two or three, but uh, how's the thing running? It's, it's running pretty good. You know, we started out and, um, you know, a little tight. We loosened it up. We got faster in the second practice, and uh, we'll loosen it up again, and hopefully we'll get faster again now. Okay. But we're uh, we're fifth quick on the timesheet. Okay. Never been here before, so wow. that's a pretty good start. Yeah, that's what I was going to ask you. You know, next. so I, I think we can have something for them. Okay. You know, good. you're a tough competitor at Speed yeah. Bowl uh, when the trucks are there, and you, you've won several races at Speed Bowl. So, uh, yeah, uh, right. here at Manadnock, what a, what a different place, huh? It is. It's really easy to overdrive it. I about went out of the ballpark there <laughs> once, you know. <laughs> And, uh, yeah, I was looking at the grass in the in the uh, gravel bank there yeah. for a minute, and then all of a sudden it turned. So yeah. we, we can't do that anymore. All right. Well, but, best uh, of luck to you. Keep all four under it, buddy. All right. Thank you. All Appreciate right. it. All right. That's Tommy Metcalf here in the pits. Here in the exit realty area, actually, but with Ben Byrne, driver of the number six sportsman modified here at Manadnock. And uh, this guy's got more stickers on his car, dude. Tell us how you're doing, man. Uh, perseverance. We spent a lot of time in the shop, uh, a lot of time in the shop, a lot more than the wife would probably appreciate. But, uh, <laughs> uh, you know, it's it's hard work and perseverance. You just got to keep at it, keep trying stuff, and, uh, you know, get your practice in. Right. All right. And you got your boy with you, Jackson, here. Yeah. Uh, Jackson, you like Dad winning all the time? Uh, yes. I love when he wins. <laughs> all right. Thank you, buddy. <laughs> ben, thank you. Thank you. And have a good night tonight. Thanks. All right. Ben Byrne here in the pits. All right, we're here in the Modified Pits with Andy Major. Andy, out of Wales, Mass, competitor, uh, uh, all season here at Nanak thus far? Yeah, we've been running all season here. This is uh, our first season with the Modifieds. We ran Pro 4s here for about 17 years. Yeah, with Missouri's and crew. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah you know, uh, won a lot of championships, a lot of races, so it was time for a change. Yeah, you know? good for you. Something Step up, that's yeah. the name of the game. Yep, tried something different. All right, how's the car working for you tonight? Oh, uh, pretty good tonight. Uh, we got wrecked two weeks ago, so it's basically a new car starting out again. Yeah, but, yeah. you know, it's, uh, it's coming around for us. All right. Good luck qualifying. Good luck in the future. Thank you. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Andy Major here in the pits.